I used a sheet of PVC and used a ruler and a marker to mark on it. I will drill holes on the market plastic sheet. I continued using multiple bolts and nuts to make the crankshaft. Next, I used two small bearings to attach to the two ends of the crankshaft that I had made. Take a PVC sheet and cut it to the size I measured. Continue to drill two two centimeter round holes on it. Next, I cut two more trapezoidal PVC sheets and drilled two holes in them. Then I installed two bearings into the two holes I just drilled. I will glue the plastic sheets together. Glue it to a piece of wood to make a base. I used two pieces of plastic pipe with a diameter of 21 millimeters, 8 centimeters long, and two pieces of plastic pipe with a diameter of 27 millimeters, 4 centimeters long. Then I used special glue to stick the two pieces of plastic pipe 4 centimeters long to the machine. Next, I used two magnets with 4 cm diameter and glued it to the 21 mm plastic tube. small 
plastic sheets to the machine to make bases for the magnets, then glued two magnets to them. We will use a small motor. I used a meter and saw that the motor generates electricity when rotating the motor. At the top of the motor, I attached a pulley to it. I used a 5 centimeter long plastic tube as a foot for the motor. Next, I use one capacitor and connect the motor and capacitor. I used rubber bands to make belts for the motor. Once the generator is completed, I will test it. First, I will use the fan to check the current. Then I used another bulb and it still worked fine. Thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe, leave a comment below the video, and visit my channel often. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.